felt I'm done with the defense Throw back and climb over your fence Hide to show, show you that I was a mess So you were shrugging your shoulders I'm closed off, that's what I told you Soon enough, everything started to change Cause there's no going back no going back, there's no going back to your own life Not living in the past, we're over that I'm feeling it tonight, riding on the dizzying high Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Jill and today I have a complete disaster clean with me and also I am kind of doing a fall clean with me, fall clean and decorate, a little bit of everything going on in this video. And on a side note, I'm just kind of proud of myself for even filming this, I guess. Just putting up the fall decor reminds me of my mom a lot. Um, if you haven't followed me before, my mom passed away about a month and a half ago and it's taken a lot out of me just to try to put the decor up because it reminds me of just shopping with her and getting some good food made and sitting down and watching a movie together with my daughter. So I'm proud of myself for at least attempting to do this and it is something that I love to do so we have to keep doing the things we love, right? On a funny note, I have probably three quarters of my fall decor because somebody, aka John, the hubby, I can't make this stuff up, I swear. When he was rebuilding the basement, he built a wall and accidentally my fall decor is stuck behind that wall. So I at least had some of it in bins and baskets and I have that part of it, but Oh honey, I told him, you know what, I'll deal with the fall decor for right now, but if there's Christmas stuff behind there, honey, you're going to be breaking down that wall. <laughs> Let's do it. Hey guys, welcome back to another complete disaster clean with me and also this fall clean and decorate. I ended up watching one of Maddie's friends and they ended up just destroying all of the main areas in my house, my living room, kitchen, and her bedroom. So I had my work cut out for me for sure. You know how it is with toddlers. They just, it's incredible how quickly they can make a mess. So I had to start somewhere and just decided that the living room would be the biggest project just because I had the most decor left over to put up there as well. If you saw my little intro there, you know that Maddie just started gymnastics class. It was so bittersweet and if you are new to my channel, my mom recently passed away just about a month and a half ago. So I've been going through all the different emotions and it was kind of surreal for to enroll Maddie into something you know her very first structured <laughs> sport but she's absolutely loving it and I'm glad that she had a friend over it was kind of the normal that I've been craving and the mess is something I can handle so I'm used to that at this point so I'm just getting everything decluttered and organized back in its place so that I can start putting out my fall decor and start feeling like myself again Take it slow, don't be 
Let's be honest for a second. Yeah, you'll be in over your head, babe. Cause there is no one other than me that can make you feel the way you feel when I hold you. I think I said enough. So luckily I still had a decent amount of my living room decor. I picked up a few new pieces like that house that you just saw. Growing up my mom always had houses for both the fall season and Christmas so it felt so great to find that piece and put it out. It just felt like I brought a part of her into the home which I really needed and I was just focused on making it feel really cozy. I'm all about having lots of blankets everywhere. Maddie loves to snuggle up in them with me and just starting those new traditions of watching the fall movies and getting into the holiday season with her now that she's growing up is going to be so much fun. I picked up a few of these velvet pumpkins from Target and these leaves. I basically went with the traditional fall colors. I just wanted to keep it that way and I think it turned out really nice and pretty and it wouldn't be me without having everything light up so I of course got some lights to incorporate in it. As you can see, Maddie was enjoying destroying my decor right away and I left her to her devices so that I could move on to cleaning up the kitchen. I just wanted to get the kitchen back organized and in order. I still had dinner to make later that day, so just clearing off the catch-all space. And I wanted to decorate the dining room table and not much more, just put up a few things up on the countertops. It really is impractical to have a ton of decor when you have young children. So I always say one day when she's older, I can really get back to how I like to decorate. But for right now, I just want things that aren't going to break and are going to mainly stay in place. We are who we are. Why don't I be me? Doing what 
So just as I was finishing up cleaning the kitchen and getting all the decor placed out, I had a delivery from Amazon, where else? And it was some of the birthday presents for Maddie. It is her third birthday coming up. I can't even believe it, you guys. Where does the time go? I really cannot believe that I'm going to be out of the terrible twos. I don't think I will miss them too much, though. Moving into her bedroom, you can see Molly is helping pick up the complete disaster that they left it. They were having so much fun though, learning their letters. It's just the cutest thing and I, I just love every second of it to be honest with you. I know that the messes won't last forever so I'm trying to enjoy it, at least learn to enjoy and love, love the chaos a little bit more because I know I'm getting towards the end of it. I think 
her turning three will be probably just as much chaos, but in different ways, and it will be really interesting to see what comes next. So I'm just putting everything back in its place, and then I really needed to get these rugs cleaned out as well. We are going to be getting a bed put into that room, so I really needed to deep clean this room, but today was just the day just to get it back in order. Dance for me Easy tiger, easy Let your hair down Come closer Let me see All your million faces And all your million mistakes You don't need to hide Come closer So that we can 